Shirt Vans sales last year approached $1 billion, but customers will notice little difference with new ownership of one of Metro Detroit's longest standing businesses. The Midwest's leading furniture and mattress retailer is selling the company to a private equity firm, THL Partners, out of Boston. The timing was right and the opportunity was there. Art Van Elslander started the company back in 1959 with a single store on Gratiot in East Detroit. The founder's son, Gary, is company president. It's going to give an opportunity to enjoy some of the fruits of his labor, and he'll be able to lay his head on the pillow uh, at night and not having the worries of 3,500 employees across five states. Those employees will all stay in place along with the management team, headed by CEO Kim Yost and Gary and David Van Elslander, and they plan to keep growing. The company is now doing business in five states with over a hundred stores, and it's that growth story that made Art Van so appealing to the private equity firms. There's a forecast in the future that we will double our store count within the next 36 months. Indianapolis, Columbus, Cincinnati, Pittsburgh, Cleveland, within 300 mile radius of our 1.3 million square foot distribution is 15 billion dollars worth of furniture and mattress sales and Gary and myself and the entire leadership team are anxious to get after it. Art Van Elslander is the sole shareholder. No price on the sale of the Art Van company uh, has been disclosed but important for customers any programs in place any warranties they of course all remain good for them. For now, we are live in Warren outside the company headquarters. Dave Llewellyn, 7 Action News. Clinda? Dave, certainly some history happening. Do you know when the new owners take over? Mid-February is what they're targeting for the date for the transaction to be complete. But again, expect much more growth in the future from Art Van throughout other areas of the Midwest. That is good news. Thank you so much, Dave.